Chocolate milk is a school lunch staple. It has been for years, but it could soon be a thing of the past. The Department of Education wants to ban it from schools in New York City, and the hot topic has local dairy farmers talking. Josh Navarro talked with one of them. Yeah, it's serious. I really do think it's important for kids to be able to have chocolate milk with their lunch. That's how dairy farmers across our area are feeling right now after hearing a proposal of banning chocolate milk in New York City schools. Mulligan says not having flavored milk at schools could have a negative impact on their way of life. The city schools do purchase a large amount of milk and for kids that aren't able to drink the milk at school, they're not going to get the nutrients they need and it's if they just have the white milk, it ends up being a huge waste, and kids aren't going to choose the white milk as much, so it's lower sales for us as well. The concern stems after officials with the New York City School District claim children who drink chocolate milk consume 30 more calories and an additional 8 grams of sugar versus those who drink regular milk. It's an effort, they say, to combat obesity. But the state's Farm Bureau says the good intention proposal could impact more than 4,000 dairy farmers across New York State and not in a good way. They sent a letter to the New York City school chancellor asking them to drop the proposed ban. The idea that kids not being able to drink milk just leads to less people purchasing milk and it's kind of a compound effect that's already an issue of people not drinking milk. So we really want to have kids have that option because they're more likely to continue to purchase. So it's for future purchasing decisions and also the other schools could take this and follow up with it. Mulligan cited a study from Cornell University of Oregon. They essentially found that schools that removed flavored milk increased the amount of food waste. School districts in San Francisco and Washington, D.C. have already banned flavored milk. In the studio, Josh Navarro, News 8. Thanks, Josh. Officials do say this is just a proposed ban on the milk. A final decision has not yet been made.